Alright, welcome back to Let's Play Legend of Mana. In the last episode, we started taking on Springan, so we're gonna finish him off after we get that coin. Oh, yeah, he's in. Oh, he can teleport around, apparently. My laggy. My sound is still kinda laggy, but I ain't gonna worry about it. And I just got hit by a skeleton. This whole thing's kinda laggy right now. This is screwing me over. Yeah, that, that hurts. So try not to get hit by that. Yay. A coin. Good. We can do rain of blood on him now. If it hits. Yeah, it did. Great. That should hurt him a lot. I'm just going to keep wailing on the power attacks. Ah, almost. Whoa. Oh, that's not cool. Alright, well, we're gonna take a nap real quick, and I'll see you in the next episode. There we go. Die. Please die. Thank you. And that's the end of that. Not a very hard boss fight. He's got some powerful attacks, but... And apparently they go across the entire screen. But I leveled up, so it's all good. Escan, please listen to me. No, Matilda. You should rest, so I'll say it. No, I will. Okay, y'all can just argue about that. Wake up. They're gonna have a sentimental moment right now. not going to let the demon gain any more power. Yeah. Matilda says Erwin means well, Deanna's caught in the middle, and Esgad and Erwin are fighting. So, that's the concept behind Esgad's stuff. And we'll get the Grand Steel. Which is more than what I thought I was going to get. The two torches. The end. Yay. We finished the torches. Two torches. Whatever. Now we get to go... Back to Gato Grotto. We get to start the event with one of my favorite boss fights in this game. So we go up here and we go right back to where we just were. See, this place, Gato Grotto, is just going back and forth, back and forth, like I said many episodes ago. So we're going to go back to the Temple of Healing. Back to the back of the Temple of Healing. Back into the Dream Weaving Room. Please go in. Thank you. Just move out of my way. There we go. I apologize to have called upon you. There is a favor I need to ask you. I sure will. Thank you. I wish you luck. In search of fairies. Alright, well, I'm going to meet y'all at the... What the hell? Um... Okay. Anyway, I don't know what the hell just happened there. I wasn't pressing a button. But I'm going to take a break and uh, meet y'all at the entrance of... Lake Kilma, that's where you want to go to find her. So I'll meet y'all at the entrance of there, and I'm going to try to figure out what the hell's wrong with my sound lagging and all that, so I'll see you in a second. Alright guys, welcome back. Um, we, I lied, I told you I'd meet you at the entrance of here, but we're actually at this place, the top. Then we become fairies if we live there. That's great. You want to do this, actually, let's see if he says anything else. Yeah, no. You want to actually meet them here, so I figured instead of showing y'all all the boring parts of walking here, we'd just walk here. So now we want to fight this thing real quick. There we go. Also, I forgot to mention, if you say no to Matilda, um, you won't ever be able to access this group, or this event. Huh, there's the cat lady. Yes, we did. Thanks. But it seems like I gotta go further. 
Yes. I came here to see everyone that I guess is true. Is it Matilda's power he wants? Or revenge? Sorry. Goodbye. Goodbye. Wait. Well, no. We want to just follow her. Or him. I guess it's a her. Ah, here's the fairies. Wait, hang on. We're going to go this way. You gotta follow her, but the thing is, we don't exactly know where she went. But it doesn't actually show where she goes, and if you leave, well, that's not good. So we'll get the experience. Hopefully we can finish this event, but there's so many little minor bullshit enemies. Let's just kill these guys, come on. Two hits, there we go. Pick up the item, let's go. Let's go. Okay, now we want to go down here. There we go. This is one of my favorite boss fights right here. That's Erwin. But we're not fighting him yet. <clears throat> You've all grown up. What are you up to? You've got the fairies on your side. What am I capable of doing? He does look like a uh, mean kind of guy. But no, I, I still say he's a pretty nice guy. Elemental no powers, taking my friend away, can't do anything about it, that's too bad, shut up. Oh, cat lady just got knocked down. Go back and tell Matilda. It, is he invincible? Oh no, he's not invincible. So we're gonna lag, apparently. Wait. Right. Is that it? Has our master truly been killed? Yeah, we, we killed your master. Um, oh, okay. I know where we're going now. Just kidding. Just keep following this path. Yeah. Ooh. So let's see, we got four more days, three more days until the election. Anybody else voting for McCain like me? Sorry, I just can't go for Obama. Not saying he's going to be a bad president, I just can't vote for him. Uh oh, we got some intense boss music here. Frickin' fairies. Where'd, where'd she go? Lord Erwin takes away the shadows that exist in us. He, make, he makes eternity begin. Oh, that's great. Oh, snap. The Boreal Hound, level 27. This dude is a badass. He's fast, and I'm about to get hurt. <laughs> Alright, well I can't move right now, so we're just going to wait. There we go. Alright, we're starting to damage him. You can hear every time I hit him, he starts crying. <laughs> well, I got on the wrong side of that. Oh, I threw him. <laughs> Alright, I am hurt. And I'm going to run way the hell over here. And crouch. Since my duck is now dead. He's going to start coming over here now. i got to stay over here. And I need to be at, at least 50. Wow. Well, in the next episode, <laughs> we're going to finish the Bo Real Hound. Hopefully. Thanks for watching, guys. This has been the Tigers here signing off. Let's play Legend of Mana. Stay tuned and watch me get a game over screen.